Tonight, America's comeback. COVID cases hitting new lows. Some hospitals now with no COVID patients at all. The country springing back to life today with parades, concerts, graduations. Good morning, folks. We've got a tremendous top story today. Quick analysis of the China weather anomaly. And of course, we've got small CMEs on their way to Earth. He just said CME impact is coming towards Earth while everybody is partying. A CME is connected to the solar flares. The solar flares is the perfect savior attacking the sun. And the solar flares will cause long lasting power outages. It's a Bible prophecy. We're at the end of Earth's existence. Perfect Savior's gamma radiation caused a um, volcano to erupt in the Congo in Africa over the weekend. So the gamma radiation caused COVID-19. The gamma radiation is what caused climate change, which is causing all the earthquakes and all the volcanoes. The gamma radiation is about to knock out all Earth's electricity with a large solar flare. Your protection comes from joining the perfect savior and following his instructions. Last week, NASA launched a plasma missile into the sky to see if the perfect savior's gamma radiation had destroyed Earth's electromagnetic field, force field, and if the sky turned green, that was going to let the Illuminati know that the perfect savior has destroyed Earth's electromagnetic force field and the sky turned green. We're at the end of this wicked world. The Messiah, the perfect savior, is a dark brown skinned man with hair like wool. He is related to the slaves that were brought to America in 1619 to fulfill a 400 year Bible prophecy in the book of Daniel and in the book of Revelations. Both books say the perfect savior is a dark brown skinned man with hair like wool. So who is white Jesus? White Jesus is an Illuminati Italian prince named Cesare Borgia. And if you worship him, you have the mark of the beast. And his family has a TV show on Netflix and on Amazon Prime called the Borgias. And they are the original crime family from 1492 when Christopher Columbus came to America to fulfill the Bible prophecy. The slaves that were brought to America are from the tribe of Judah. Judah is um, uh, that map is from the United States. Um library of congress so you can't say i'm a liar they have the map with the name of judah and judah is one of the 12 tribes of the chosen bloodline judah is one of the tribes that are most important on this earth and the messiah is from the tribe of judah and judah had to go under a 400 year slave prophecy for telling the italian illuminati to kill the perfect savior in 2021 the land of judah is called oida benin in the west coast of Africa. But the Igbo in Nigeria are from the tribe of Judah. The Igbo in Nigeria are related to the perfect savior, the true Messiah, whose name is King Yahushua, not Jesus. Jesus is a white Italian Illuminati prince and his name means earth pig. But his original name is Cesare Borgia. If you are from Fiji, if you are from Samoa, if you are from um, Indonesia, you are from the perfect savior's bloodline. If you are from Tonga, if you are from Papua New Guinea, you are from the perfect savior's bloodline. If you are in Jamaica and you're from the slave bloodline, if you're from Brazil and you're from the slave bloodline, if you are an original Mexican, if you're an original Nicaraguan, Nicaraguan, you are from the Hebrew bloodline. If you are a native in a country and your people speaks your invaders language like English, Spanish, French, or Dutch, you are a Hebrew. We went under a 400 year enslavement and oppression curse from 1619 to 2019. That's why the Europeans came into your land and forced you to speak their language and worship their white God, white Jesus, because we were under a 400 year curse and now we're in the awakening and COVID-19 was part of the punishment, but it's only the beginning. 
There are 12 tribes, nine scattered to the four corners of the earth before the perfect savior came down to earth to share the light. And then he was killed by the Italian Illuminati when we, the tribe of Judah, told the Italian Illuminati to kill him in the year 33. We scattered to the four corners of the earth using large catamaran. That's how we went to all of the different islands in the Pacific Ocean and made it all the way from Africa, what they call Africa, to the Caribbean islands, the Hawaiian islands and the Americas. And now 2021 is our awakening. We are at the end of the world. Bob Marley's songs were about a Bible prophecy, a 400 year Bible prophecy that has ended. And now the seven seals has begun. Terrorism is at an all time high. 400 people were shot on Mother's Day weekend. And the perfect savior is attacking the sun with gamma radiation. As soon as a large solar flare hits the sun, electricity on earth goes out. The true Messiah, King Yahusha, is attacking the sun with gamma radiation. Gamma radiation caused COVID-19, not 5G. I said this was going to happen on December 14th, 2019, before China got attacked. And I made a video about 5G versus the Holy Spirit gamma radiation. 5G does not even exist in India. And in India, it went from 43,000 deaths to 266,000. During this devil's hour at 3.38 a.m. If Satan and the Illuminati were in control of anything, they would have turned white Jesus into a white man in the Bible. But they couldn't, and they didn't, because they ain't in control of nothing. Learn more about plasma physics and Earth's magnetic field in moments than they have in about a decade. And for those on the ground who see it, Take in the preview of the end of the world. When Earth's field collapses or when the sun unleashes a monster eruption at us, the charged particle bombardment of the atmosphere will cause the exact same glow. Take in the preview of the end of the world. Preview of the end of the world. Preview of the end of the world.